Temperatures today warmed into the lower 30s for those highs. We had some peaks of sunshine early on, then clouds built back into the forecast. Overall, pretty quiet conditions to start the work week out on Monday here. Quiet weather week overall, just a couple chances for some light snow uh, this week. And then seasonable type temperatures will continue, which will be great for social ice Thursday and Friday. And then snow, I think we are best chance for some accumulating snowfall will be coming up on Sunday. Currently outside, while well, we have temperatures right at 28 degrees, our Lewis and live camera throughout the rest of the night. Notice no chances for any type of snow or rain on the way tonight. We'll drop those temperatures down pretty quick, though. We'll be down into the upper teens by about midnight tonight. So slowly drop those temperatures down. We continue with some cloudy skies outside, so cloud cover will continue. Unfortunately, we didn't get a ton of sunshine today like we were able to uh, earlier on this week or past weekend. Quiet weather week then. We still deal with the light to flurry chances coming up Thursday into Friday. Should not impact socialize too much coming up on Friday. Our best chance though will be on Sunday. Quick moving clipper system moves through. That's our best chance for accumulating snowfall again. Still almost a week out, but to right now all indications point to Sunday being the one day of this seven day stretch where we could potentially see some accumulating snowfall. Temperatures tonight then dropping down. We're into the upper teens by about midnight tomorrow morning as you wake up. Temperatures will be right around 12 to 13 degrees. We'll see some partly cloudy skies. A little bit more sunshine will help temperatures a little bit, but I think we stay pretty steady right around 18 to 20 degrees for those highs tomorrow. So by the lunch hour, we hit that uh, 20 degree mark there in Rochester. For the most part, we stay right around 20 degrees because of the cloud cover. Now throughout the overnight hours, Tuesday night into Wednesday, we will drop those temperatures down a little bit. We'll be closing in on the single digits late Tuesday into your early Wednesday morning. So a brisk one to start out uh, your Wednesday this week. Now, as we look at social ice, Thursday through Saturday, we're looking at pretty comfortable conditions for this time of year. Perfect conditions really for social ice. We'll be live down there five and six for both Thursday and Friday. We're looking at 26 for that Iowa and partly cloudy skies on Thursday. Friday, a couple chances for some light flurries. Saturday, overall temperatures fairly nice as well with some sunshine right around 24 degrees for that high. Your town forecast for tonight, southeastern Minnesota. Temperatures dropping down to around 12 to 13 degrees with that cloud cover. Northeastern Iowa, more the same, about 13 to 14 degrees for those overnight lows. Your town forecast tomorrow southeastern Minnesota temperatures will range from anywhere about 18 to upwards of 23 degrees. If we see some peaks of sunshine, that will really help jump our temperatures up into the lower 20s. Northeastern Iowa more of the same. Some cloud cover temperatures right around 20 degrees. Your seven day forecast 23 then for the high Wednesday and then social ice guys as we're down there. Perfect conditions mid 20s can't really complain about being out for social ice. We don't have to worry about the KTTC ice desk melting. Mm -hmm. We don't have to worry <laughs> about that. Yes. So, Never good so thing. that's good. And then uh, overall, no snow really on the way until Sunday. Meantime, can we talk about this past weekend? I mean, what Absolutely. was that all about? Absolutely. The sun was compared miraculous. To, compared to 2019. The polar vortex. Yeah, a little different. We can't forget that. Yikes. Either. All right, thanks. Well, up next, Pat.